was very happy, very proud. I was convinced, never had doubt, Poland is a great power, fifth or sixth greatest power in Europe. And I remember uh, once or twice I took part in some demonstration, public demonstration. I was proud, happy, and very, very stupid at that time. He was a dashing, heroic, attractive figure uh, with his wrist slashed because when he was captured by the Gestapo, he tried to commit suicide in order not to crack under torture. And then in dramatic circumstances was rescued by the underground. I saw horrible things. Never in my life I imagined that I would see what I saw in the Warsaw Ghetto. I saw a man standing with blank eyes. I asked the guide, what is he doing? The guide whispered, he's just died, he's just died. We have no means of actively opposing the German murders. We cannot overcome them or save anybody, but we protest from the bottom of our hearts, which are filled with compassion, poisoning and horror. That protest is demanded of us by God who has forbidden us to kill. It is demanded by the Christian conscience. Every creature calling itself a man has the right to the love of his neighbor. The blood of the helpless calls to the heavens for vengeance. Yes, people, all of us probably, we have 
infinite power to do good. And we have infinite power to follow evil. We have a choice. We can choose to be robbers, we can choose to be good people. But our Lord left us the choice. Many people cho chose evil.